Hello again everyone. In this video tutorial, I will show you a super easy way to convert from decimal degrees into DMS and vice versa. And by the way, DMS stands for degrees, minutes and seconds as you can see over here. One more thing just I want you to to let you know that uh, degrees could be represented in this kind of notation as I put down degrees, minutes and seconds. One more thing I want to tell you that one degree is always equal to 60 minutes and one minute equal to 60 seconds and finally if you look at both of them so that turns out to be that one degree equals to 3600 seconds. So let's go ahead and take care of this very first example. We want to convert this DMS form, degrees, minutes, and second form into decimal degrees. The very first step, what I want you to do is, I want you to put down these, just split them up. I want you to put down 42, and then I want you to put a plus sign in between 24 and then plus what? 36. And the next thing what I want you to do is we know that the 42 degrees, just leave it alone. As far as 24 degrees minutes, when you divide by 60, it's going to give you degrees. So no wonder we're going to divide this, the second part, always by 60. And this last one by 3600 because there, there are 3600 seconds in one degree. So once you have achieved this target dividing by 60 and dividing by 3600, next thing I want you to use your calculator and put this fraction into decimal. So that's going to simply become 42 plus this becomes 0 0.4 and this simply become 0.01. Once you have done that one, I want you to add these numbers. So once you add them, that is simply going to become what? 42.41. And that is our complete answer. That turns out to be what? 42.41 degrees. So that's we started out with the DMS form and converted into this decimal degree form and that is our answer and in this second example we want to convert this degrees decimal into dms form degrees minute seconds so first i want you to do one thing i want you to put down somewhere here dms I want to make sure that you put down DMS over here, degrees, minutes, and seconds. The next thing what I want you to do is look at this thing, any number right before this decimal on the left hand side number, this the whole number, and this is on the right hand side is the decimal part. I want you to put down 83 right under degrees over here and put the decimal part this 0.46 right up here so you see what we did we got this one the whole number part 83 under d and the decimal part we got it over here next what we're going to do is so this is our step number one by the way i want you to make sure i want you to multiply this one by 60. Once you multiply by 60, this turns out to be what? 27.6. You can use your calculator. Once again, your left hand part before decimal is 27. I want you to write it down under M right now. So 27 is going to go this part right up here. And the next thing what I want you to do is look at the decimal part is what? 0.6. Here it was what? 
0.46 here is 0.6 so our second step I what I want you to do is step number two is simply what I want you to do is put down that 0.6 right up here and I want you to multiply this number by 60 once again once you multiply by 60 that's gonna 0.6 times 60 is gonna be 36 so this whatever number turns out to be you're gonna put it under s seconds so this turns out to be 36 so what really our complete answer is i want you to put down 83 degrees 27 minutes and 36 seconds and that is our answer here is another example. Look at this thing. In this one, we're going to be converting 60 degrees, 5 second, uh, five minutes, sorry, and 56 seconds. Same thing again. I want you to split them up, divide the minute part by 60, and divide the seconds part by 3600. Just put them, these fractions, into decimal, add them up, and that's going to be your answer. And finally, in this example, we want to convert these degrees decimal into DMS. Once again, as previously I explained it to you, put down DMS somewhere over here. And then look at this thing on, the, on this example over here that your uh, left hand side number, whatever, right before the decimal part is what? 24 is come right up here, 24 is right up here then put down the decimal part which is what 0.513 is right up here and multiply by 60 we got this number once again this 30 the whole number right before the decimal just put it under m and once again your decimal part is 0.78 multiply this one by 60 again and we got 46.8 and now if it is a decimal like it turns out to be i want you to round it off it rounds out rounds off to 47 and this 47 appears under second s so our complete answer turns out to be a 24 degrees 30 minutes and 47 seconds and that's your answer thanks for watching